Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I've done many, many of videos on text to path, and I can't really find one that I've done text and path on the inside of a circle. When you do the inside, it's never as good because it's going to scrunch the letters up top, maybe depending on the font. So let's just go to text, text to path, and see it immediately puts it on top. But if you just keep going straight down, it'll re-scramble the letters, and then you could put it on the inside and wait till you get that red line. Now we know it's backwards, so we'll just do this. And then you have to take that X and bring it down to that line. Now this is what I was talking about, that it looks squashed up. And we're not, it's not in the center yet. So as soon as you see that red line, you're basically in the, well, I moved it afterwards. It's kind of a good trick. And you'll kind of see it's even across the top. It's a little bit off. But you you got the word. Just, the word just doesn't look good. But you can take the shape tool on a, on a text to pass. So just grab your shape tool. Take this handle right here and just expand it out. And it'll put your letters apart. <clears throat> now, some of them look like they're worse than the other ones. But you can always take your shape tool and grab that node and, and bring those letters in or out. And you can actually hold down the shift key. Nugget, yeah, and grab both those letters at the time, time, same time and bring them in. Kind of make them look a little more normal. Now, when you do that, you're off. And I don't think there's anything you can do about it with the exception of, because I don't think you can move it now because you've uh, used the um, shape tool to work on it, but you can do this. You can go to object, break text apart, grab this text. <clears throat> and if, especially if it's a circle, you could move this to the center of the text and then ever so slightly just rotate it around. It'll stay on that same path. Now, just on another side note, and I, I don't ever do it because I get so used to uh, going up to the menu and text the path and hitting text the path. You can and that's one of the reasons I decided to make the video to add to it a little bit. Click on it, but hold down your right mouse button and put it on the put it on the path. And then right here it says text to path. So it's like a a mouse job. You don't have to run up here and go text to path. But I still do it just because I I prefer doing it that way. But you can see this looks more normal than it is on the inside. Anyway, I hope that answered their question, and thank you for watching.